Resident Evil Revelations. Hello everyone, this is Robert from Robert's Discount Gaming, and welcome back to episode 3 of Let's Play Resident Evil Revelations. In the last episode, uh, I, I died, and you are looking at that screen right now as this is the same recording session. So, basically, Jill was captured, Jill and Parker were captured, and we've just got our weapons back. I unfortunately didn't play very well, and we are now, we are now at the death screen, so we're just going to have to continue from where we, where we left off. And hopefully that won't happen again for a while. Where are we now? Oh, what is up here? Oh yeah. We died a little further on from here. Ignore this guy. So I believe in this area is where I got myself killed. Ooh. There, nice dodge. So yeah, if you press the W key at the right time or the space key, you do a dodge. Ooh. That guy that guy's a bit stronger. Ah. Okay, maybe it won't do it if it's from behind. That's the guy who killed me last time. Not this guy. But he looks a bit tougher than the other ones. Or at least different. He's got extra spikes in his pincers. Ooh. Oh. It's, uh, it seems like something you can kick him at, if I remember correctly. Scanning, try to get a healing item as soon as possible. Do I have any? Nope. Ah, nice dodge. Shoot this down now. And now we're into a new section that we haven't seen yet. Okay, some sort of. What kind of key is that? Helm mark. So the helm key is how we get out of here. Some kind of elevator. I don't trust there's nothing gonna. No? Okay. Uh, bridge? Are we on the bridge? No, we're on the lower cabins. We'll go to bridge. <laughs> so that's where you said we were heading. It's gotten quiet. Oh, it's already knocked off. See what they have to say about this. Someone's been here. Yep, that's what I thought. Okay. Ooh, there we go. That's what I'm looking for. Nothing. Shotgun ammo. Oh, yeah. In my recollection, there's a bit of backtracking in this game. Usually, you find a new key. It's like. Pretty much the Resident Evil staple. Doesn't look like it can be used for communications. Handgun ammo case. Increases your ammo capacity. You can check the maximum capacity in a menu with F2. Communication system is down. We can't change our course. We're completely adrift. This is recent. The perpetrator can't be far. Let's see. Well, that's our escape route gun. They count on Chris Don't and tell Jessica. Me that was the tugboat. Shit, we'll be stuck here. Damn. Look at that. Yours, 
didn't know each other, wait. That was our Ooh. Episode done. We were close on last episode. To being to finish with double mystery. It's definitely left a bit of a mystery. Yeah, A is again. Not even an S. I've got an S if I didn't die. Eh, overall A rank isn't too bad. I'm not a pro at these games. So we'll drop a manual save. It's definitely worth being cautious with saving in games. That's our next chapter. Hopefully it doesn't do it previously because we're, we're just... Oh, we've just previously, been through it, but... Resident Evil Revelations. Might be able to catch anyone who, who's joining in a bit late. Jesus. No one could have lived through that. And stories of their resurrection are true. Then the Beltrow. setup that got Jill and Parker. It was all... <laughs> it's a trap! Yeah, I'd almost guarantee it. But Ryan, we'll go after Jill and Parker. Make your way to the Mediterranean. Where? Damn it. Master took all my weapons. Can you reach HQ? No. Comms are as it seems. See what this red-haired guy has to do. Has to do with this situation. Episode 3, Ghosts of Veltro. Oh, this is Terragrigia. The, uh, the city that was destroyed because Veltro released a BOW. It's Biological Organic Weapon, I believe they're called, is what BOW stands for. Still hurting, Cadet? No. I can still fight. That's the spirit. It's, it's Parker and the red hair guy. The city is finished. <sighs> Alright. Ammo. Never say no to ammo. Your efforts are commendable. This is one wake up call which was long overdue. Wait, what? Need a mayor? Jessica, Parker, come in. The facility has been. That's breached. Jessica? We're closing shop. Prepare to go home. Split up and get to the helipad on the roof. That's an order. I'll cover the hallway with Jessica. Cadet, make sure they reach the heliport. Fine. Parker, they've started evacuation procedures here. Yeah. Let's go. Ooh. You think this is it? Not if we shoot all them sons of bitches first. Okay. What have we got? Oh. Must be the hunters that we saw in the first um the news report. Yeah, so hunters are a big staple of Resident Evil games, at least, especially in uh, the first game. First game is where they were introduced. I believe they came back in Resident Evil 3 on the PS1. And I'm not too sure what other games they've showed up. I think they've showed up in like, Resident Evil Survivor, that um, first person shooter. Yes, there was a first person Resident Evil game before Resident Evil 7. It wasn't well received though, so not many people talk about it. Resident Evil 7 was where it definitely hit off a lot better with first person uh, gameplay. Definitely needed all that ammo anyway. What other guns do I have? Don't have any other guns. Just about out of ammo. Might be more ammo around here if we have to search. That takes care of that. Right. 
Now it's our turn to get on that chopper. Aha, there we go. Yeah, we follow Jessica. She looks very different from, well, I suppose she's in a, a sort of winter outfit in the part we played with Chris and her. At least we have a little bit more ammo. It's not a wall, that's a window. Oh, Usually I always tell myself never trust an elevator in a horror game. And yes, I didn't listen to my own advice. Sorry to drag you into this. That's fine, but you're buying me dinner next time. And I'm ordering lobster. <laughs> I'm not a fan of stairs. I'm not sure how I feel about stairs. Which Jessica? Oh, you dodge. Didn't even mean for that one. This my inner gamer just came out. Inner pro gamer, more like. already. Let's take a lot of bullets. And I don't have many. Ooh, shotgun. Nice. M3. I don't know much about guns, so I wouldn't really know names for guns. Oh. I did have other weapons. What do you know? Stick a handgun for the time being. Be a big old powerful one he has. Bit of healing. We have a FBC's charter. Federal Bioterrorism Commission was founded in the US government to be the forcing agent of the guidelines set forth in the National Species Protection Act. Um, this seems to be a bit long, so if you want to read it, I will let you pause and read it as, we, as you want to. So feel free to pause to read those bits of dialogue. There you go. And we'll continue on. Shotgun ammo. Always welcome. Grenade. Nice little ammo deposit here. Wow. This handgun's better than the goddamn soap machine gun we had. Breaking enemy. Oh, they hit hard. The heal up. Ah, that's what I needed. Replacement for my healing. Some handgun ammo. Nice. Nothing. Grenade. Very handy. There's a sort of limited amount of grenades you can have. Machine gun ammo. Nothing. And nothing, of course. Any bits of information we can so, read? What do you think about that O'Brien guy? BSAA director? Not my type. <laughs> That's not what I meant. I think he's in the right. He needs to stand up to General Morgan. And down. Yeah, I agree. I Climb think over this. Being in the uh -huh. FBC destroyed you. your moral compass. You sound just like him. Still, I wouldn't mind being on the right side of the fight. Ooh. Slice the dice. And 
just out of my machine gun ammo. Perfect. Right over there. Stairs. Nice. Sixth floor, it's on four. Level five. Ooh. Oh, one more. Level six. I want to have to fight more hunters than I have to. Here we go. Um quarters. Take the shotgun with me. Adding in those lockers. Yeah. Parker was a bit of a badass before. Or joining Jill. Didn't actually think Parker would have been there. Ooh. Jesus Christ, these guys take a lot of hits. Double kill. Tab. Get some healing going. Uh, quick. Change weapon. I'm gonna waste all the shotgun ammo. Although it was very, um, underwhelming there. I expected the shotgun to do a lot more damage to those guys. They were scary in the first game. They were fast and they just tore you apart if you weren't ready for them. We can get through here. Give me a hat. Okay, I'm coming. That one's very pessimistic. She's like, yeah, we're, we're screwed. For the love of God! Jessica, hurry! <laughs> They're literally right there. They're just gonna stand there, wait for us to open the fucking gate. <laughs> Very kind hunters. Very kind. Ammo. Forgot I had grenades. That could have been handy. Some healing. More ammo. They're off getting this ammo now before the. I'm assuming there's gonna be like a big horde of them coming. While we wait for the elevator. That healing. So yeah, th this is the tower that you see crumbling. Um, in a news broadcast for... Uh, Come on. For almost here. Sort of exposition newscast. I think they're here for you. Because you're a flirt. Could have kicked him there if I wanted. Honestly, I didn't even think of it. Dead. Yeah, as I assumed, was a sort of horror thing coming. Swap weapon. Let's go with the shotgun. How close is that to getting here? Oh! I think so before these guys hit hard. I mean, the caution straight away. See? Bunch! Ooh, Parker, what a boss! Ooh, get away! Oh! Stairs. 
Stay down. Stay down, good boy. There's the elevator. Get out of here. Ooh. I should just kind of run it, so. Jessica, what are you waiting for? Oh. Swipe. Let's get in. Jesus. Only have pistol ammo left. Hopefully, not much more fighting. Jesus, I thought it was going to stop again. Yeah, we we're fine. But that was crazy. I can't believe Morgan decided to fry the city with the solar energy satellite. Wrecking the city all over again. Yes. Wiped off the face of the earth. By tomorrow morning, Terra Grigia will be just a name in a history book. Uh, there's a ruin there. You see it later on. Well, earlier in, the, in this playthrough. I hope we did. Well, just don't forget about that lobster dinner you earlier. <laughs> when have I ever gone back on my work? Well, we don't know. No more ammo around, so I doubt there's much fighting left. Get the lead out. We gotta go. Okay, ladies first. Ah, fuck that, I'm getting out of here. Wait, what? Oh, <laughs> I, I didn't know we were in the helicopter already, I thought. Helicopter just took off without us. Ooh, I just see the actual destruction. See, the idea was that uh, Terra Grigia was using a lot of green power. I believe this uh, satellite was either used to intensify the sun for the solar panels, but now it's being used to basically melt the city. Yeah, see, it's a lot of solar panels. It's triggered a chain reaction. Look, the city. The city is so bright. Yeah, burn them bad boys. Set that battlefield trailer all over again. No more. We came to help, but did nothing. Well, there was a lot of, a lot of hunters. Don't feel too bad, Jessica. Right. Accuracy could have been better. Drop an old manual save. Always good. Remember kids, save your game. Don't want unexpected crashes ruining it. Seems to be auto saves, but... Uh, I'm a paranoid man, I don't trust those things. Raymond? That's you, isn't it? Raymond is his name. The BSAA. A little too late. What is the FBC doing here? <laughs> answer me, Raymond. I don't have to answer anything. It's... You have no authority over this. There's no time to fight. We've got to... Give it a rest. I don't even know why you're here or who you're fighting. Raymond, stop right there. Nothing will change unless you get your hands dirty. Sounds like something you heard on Facebook. So the FBC is on this ship too. 
What's going on here? We're operating without any intel. We need to search this ship for answers. Not that I relish the idea. The fire presumes to go in this direction. Must be leading me. Let's have a look around here. Oh. Down you go. Another door that needs a key. Ooh, what's in here? Helm key. That's something we were looking for. Like I said, um, this game has some backtracking in it. It's not... Uh, it can be annoying, but... Uh, it's not too bad. Ooh, custom parts. Upgrade for our weapon next time we get a new one. Or we can put it on our handgun again. Though I suspect we'll be able to get that shotgun soon. Which would, wouldn't be dismissed by me. So, oh, but, uh, some handgun ammo and a green herb. I have some healing anyway. It's not working. Okay. Well, it wasn't useless coming down this direction. Got something out of it. Do you have a map? Ah, there's the map. It's kind of a 3D map. So, doors that can't be opened yet with the orange key. More cabins. Ah, so we need to go to the upper cabins where there seems to be a helm key door. How about lower cabins? So gun there. Don't think we have what we need to get that yet. Yeah. So we're going to the upper cabins. See if we can get that door open. If I can remember where it is. Jeep, where are you going? We haven't investigated anything yet. Ugh. Forgot we are doing an investigation. Let's have a look. Handprint. Too far to scan. Oh, maybe I'm supposed to investigate something in that room? Because I'm not seeing anything I can scan up here. that button there. No? Odd. Okay. I guess it is back in that room. I guess there was a reason we were sent down here. Oh, that'll... Oh! Wow, I'm blind. Anyway, I'm just gonna check in here. If I remember correct, yeah, there's a document here. Yeah. Yeah. Ship layout. Okay, some of these are useful, so it might be a good idea to read them. For all staff and crew, the Queen Zenobia is a pressure clu cruise liner that provides world class service with the comfort of a luxury hotel for our passengers. This ship offers numerous services and facilities for our guests. As a representative from this ship, it is your job to be familiar with all the fa facilities that can be found here. F the following out list outlines some of the major facilities of the ship. Please read each one carefully. Promenade Hall, boasting an area of 1500 meters squared. The ship's promenade hall has three floors and is very sp and is more spacious than any other ship in the world. The interior is done in a gothic style with ceilings covered in the chandeliers. It's beautiful in style. It's beauty in style. Rivals out of the finest opera houses. Okay. I, I feel this is fluff text, so. so there's a casino, restaurants and shops, emergency communication room. There's an emergency communication room next to the promenade that can be used as a safety point during an emergency. That might be where we should go. Do I take that? It's not like yeah. Just read it again. 
Yes, there's a few places that we should go, but probably the emergency communication room might be the best. You know, since we're trying to contact people. Use the helm key. And in we go. Another document. Scared a message. Oh god, please help me. This can't be happening. Don't leave me to die in this hell. I'm trapped here. There's monsters here. Real ones. Everyone's dead or dying. There are no survivors. Shit, we're all going to die. Pretty dark. What's this here? Upper interior map. We should find an emergency communication room if we go through the mm -hmm. hall. The crest. Might get to shock him with that. History of Queen Zenobia. Okay, this is going to be another fluff text, so I'll let you pause and read each one uh, yourselves as if I was to go through all the documents in this game then we could be going hours for this game. Oh, sorry. I'll go back and uh, do the pages again. There we go. Ooh. Ooh. It's, uh, it's pretty nasty. Wouldn't want to be that guy. Some handgun ammo. Nice. Okay. We should go to the emergency communication room. Maybe try to contact HQ. Maybe this will work now this time. No, still not working. Okay. Yeah, you know, sometimes in video games, these things just work for no reason. Okay. Right. We got to find Rain. How do you know him? I used to work with him. Let's leave it at that. Yeah. So I'm gonna leave it here. Um, want to thank everyone for sticking through and continuing with the series with me. Uh, if, if you wouldn't mind dropping a like, maybe subscribing. Share with your friends if they're interested in Resident Evil. And I will see you in the next video when we continue with Resident Evil Revelations. Goodbye.